All right, filming out of the GoPro. No, I do not have the helmet, but man, I could just bust it. Is this the last time you guys gonna see the Ninja 100? Yeah, baby. Man, that dog, that dog does not stay quiet, bro. Always barking every time I come up. Find one of these at Facebook Market. Pick it up later. But right now we're gonna go visit this dealership, which is an hour away. I'm gonna go check it out, and see what's up. She is dirty. Today is a beautiful day. So right now we're just gonna head to meet up with this person. He's literally eight minutes away, man. So that came in clutch. Um, the only thing I'm worried about is that he cut the uh, rear wiring where it just where you plug it in. He cut. It looks like he cut it. But I have my OEM wiring, so I'm kind of curious how I can just transfer it. I'm still trying out this GoPro. I'm using the selfie stick right now. And um, we're, about a, we're about like an hour away, like I said, to this sh dealership. And they got some cool stuff in there, man. So I wanted to check it out. So far the, the quality looks great man i just need i'm just waiting the N nd filters to come in and probably buy a wide lens even though you can still record wide on these gopros one of my homies shout out to lightspeed he has a h2 uh he comment um dude i didn't even know you were watching my videos bro that's crazy <laughs> but he commented that he doesn't like this new gopro because it doesn't record the speed so, and you know, when you have an H2 on a bike like that, you want to record the speed, man. You want to know that the boys know how fast you're going, you know? So, I don't know. Probably they're going to update that or change it. I don't know. But coming from a GoPro 8, or what I have, 7 or 8, to a 12, man, that's a, I think that's a good come up, bro. And it's really nice out here, guys. That's so nice, dude. Look at this, dude. This is. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Look at this. This guy got a whole strap holding about a whole pad. Look at this. This is, dude. One snap out of this shit, dude. It's crazy. Gotta smash my whole front end. My truck only has forty-eight thousand miles, and it's a two thousand six. So I barely take this baby girl out. The only reason I took it out because I didn't bring my GMC because I got the I got my homies back here. They chilling. The this is my CEO and my accountant checking out my number, see if I can afford this new bike. <laughs> oh fuck. I should've never been here. They got like a car wash here. Man, we're in the middle of nowhere. Look at these roads. Look at all this land, man. It's a whole big different vibe compared to the city. Man, if you had a bike out here, look at these smooth roads, man. This thing is buttery. Ain't no pajo. Well, this little street right here, but it ain't nothing compared to what they, they got in the city, man. So we're only like 11 minutes away, and I missed my exit, so. I was jamming to my music and scoping out the, the view out here. We're almost there, not that far. Really nice out here, man. I don't know about you, but Wisconsin's a little more colder than Chicago. I don't know why. Yeah, I don't, I don't spot not one biker out here. I spot a lot of Harley drivers. I saw a lot of guys riding their Harleys out here, but I didn't see no sport bikes in the highway. I only saw Harley people cruising and bruising, baby. All right, we made it. Man, this is a big ass store, bro. They got Kawasaki, CO2, Yamaha. They got boats up in here. I'll just go in here real quick. Right in front because I got my dogs here. Got the showroom right there. Let me just go inside. I bet. Hey. 
Oh uh, yeah, I'm about to get a new bike. All right, let's see what they got in here, man. Right away, they got boats. 16,000. Man, should I just buy a jet ski? Look at this one. 14,000, bro. Jeez. Sick. This place is huge. We got big jet skis over here. Yeah, I don't really know. So this is the jet ski area. Yeah, I didn't go to Kawasaki and make jet skis. Damn, look at this one, dude. This one's sick. It's green. It's nasty. Jesus. This is big boy money right here, man. This one's catching my attention. You got carbon fiber. This is green. This is my spec right here. Yeah, for 17,000. That's it. Screw the bike. I'm getting to get this. So we're actually at the wrong location. We actually have to go four miles down. But so you know, these, they got these boats in here. We're not there yet, so we can wait on these boats. Jet skis. Sick though. Pretty sick. All right, now we're at the right location. All right, let's go check it out. We got Hondas up in here now. Got Kawasaki's. That's the service area. We got four wheelers over there. Check these out. Dang, they got more snowmobiles. Jeez. We got everything up in here, bro. Look at this. Man, these are all for service. Got these skis for the snow. Man, that's crazy. I wonder how much these go for. I think they go for the same thing as a boat. Almost 1800 Let's get you see what they got in here. Jeez, they got a lot of bikes up in here, man. Damn, check this out. The C900, 11,000. Sick. Damn, they got a lot of bikes. Yamaha poster. Yamaha R1. Sick. And a dirt bike. Two grand for these? Almost three grand in Texas? It's not bad, bro. Hey, you guys be robbing them? Hey, these things are badass. Chasaka, Saki, Honda, Suzuki. 650. Man, these are pretty tall, bro. Look at this thing. It's pretty tall. So. Damn, it's just green. Nice. Damn, this looks like my Ninja 400. It's like the same. It just added this. 10 grand, bro. Jeez. It's a 650. Like a naked bike. Cool. Yeah, we got a hell of helmets over here, guys. Jeez. I got a bit of everything up in here. What the hell? I don't know how you wear that. JHC. 
Ooh, this one's sick. This is Matt right here. <laughs> Dude, they got everything up in here, guys. They got helmets, they got bikes, dirt bikes, jackets, gear, overalls for your jet skiing. 300 bucks. It's not bad. Check this out. They got decent jackets. Man, this is a spot. It's only an hour away from Chicago. Nuts. Check out this four. I don't even know what the hell you call these. Polaris. Yeah, I guess these are the used bikes. Dude, this place is huge. Holy shit. Okay, look at this all plank stuff. This thing's nasty. Their bikes. Look at these boys. Things are crazy. One of my boys just got one of these. Things are fully loaded. Alright guys, we're gonna go to the backpack. Check it out guys, they got way more stuff in here. Way more inventory. They got about everything you need. They got a ZX10R. They got two, right? And they got 650, ZX10R, ZX6R. Got another R1. Another ZX6R. Is this the 4RR? Yeah. Damn. I don't want to get another four though. <laughs> but this thing sounds just like this thing. Isn't that crazy? Mm -hmm. You know what's sad? When I bought my bike, this just came out the next year after. I'm like, what the fuck? Man, my, my, one of my closest friends got the R7. You guys remember that in the channel? Dude, they got everything up in here, guys. That is nuts. Come get your new bike over here, right? Come see uh, Scott. Yes, sir. Come see Scott, man. Look at 17,429, 2024, ZX14R. This thing is huge. They have another one. This is another one, right? It's the black one? Yep. Just the regular color, not the anniversary. Okay. Still looks good, though. They got Hayabusa, right? Hayabusa? Yep. Anniversary edition of the Hayabusa. Jesus. Man, hurry up and go and get your bikes, guys. They got everything up in here. They, I didn't even see this one. I know you guys love this green. I personally don't like it, in my opinion, but it's sold already, so if you wanted it, it's gone. <laughs> this one sold, too. Like, this one's already, this R7 sold. Congratulations to Anthony right there. But they still got these right here. But we don't know what we want. I might just go with the... Uh, the marine boats over there that just made that quick stop. I'm like, hey. Man, they got everything. Got third bikes. Jeez. This is so cool, man. You guys got a lot of inventory. This is this blue is nasty. Jeez. Here you go, guys. 60K. No bike. Same R1. Uh, three over here. Nice. Brand new. Stock. Three thousand. Got this blue ground. 
Oops, red one. Check this thing out. Look at this crew. Look at the seat. I want one of these two. Keep this up. Tell you, they got everything up in here. All right, guys. So that place is huge, man. Look, down here, down the street, they got Indian motorcycles. It's pretty empty in there. There's nobody in there. <laughs> but, dude, that place was huge. I just wanted to check them out. You guys have saw a lot of bikes. Uh, they got a good, they got a couple bikes in there, man. And the guy Scott saying they might get sold out. So right now, I don't know if I'm at the right place to buy a new bike or if I should. Comment down below. Where you? Hope you guys enjoy the video. I'm heading back home. I'm gonna try to see if I can install that uh, piece in the rear of the ninja what should be the next what would be your next bike like if you had a chance to buy a next bike what would it be man for me i legit don't know what i want i just right now i'm just trying to still focus like i said on the business make it bigger um i came to check this place out place is huge they have a lot of stuff they got a lot of merch aftermarket parts they got a lot of things never been there before uh, I want to visit every moto dealership here in Illinois. That wasn't that far. Uh, I was going to go check out DSP Kawasaki, but for some reason, they're always closed on Mondays. Damn, you guys see what I see? Dude is cleaning this car with the squeegee of the uh, gas station, bro. Look, 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 look. Oh, shit. The G35. Look, he's squeegeeing it. Oh, hell no, nah, dude. Damn. One of these G35s be coming out scratched up. They're using the squeegee on the gas station, bro. Jeez. Damn, where are we going to buy that G37? 35 just keep eye out. Had a big sticker in the rear end. <laughs> 